<laughs> he was the ice in the hole! <laughs> Man, the 90s was a wild place. And today we're gonna explore that wild place because I still have collectibles. <laughs> and we're gonna have a look at them and see if they're actually worth anything. Because we watched a video earlier about like value of baseball cards and other stuff. And, yeah. And then who knows, there might be a treasure trove in yeah. here. Before like, you know, NFTs, you actually just had to have a physical item that yeah. couldn't be like fucking replicated. Here's a drawing that someone else did that I stole and I'm selling it for. <laughs> yeah. I printed someone else's drawing and wrote my name on the back. <laughs> there you Give go. me money. Yeah. Um, so you choose one of these containers. No, I'm going to choose the one. That, now, like, these I are, was... are, are ice cream containers, the collectible ice cream containers. <laughs> of course they That are. you used to get back in the day, the Toy Story. Hold it, hold it up to so the camera. So ice cream actually, oh yeah, this is another ice cream on the side, yeah. It's actually, there was three liters of ice cream Toy in this. Toy Story fucking. Um, and what, what are we going to find in this one? Some shit. Oh, some shit. Oh, wait a I'm second. I'm excited. <laughs> it's Barney in pog form. That's a Barney the Barfly. <laughs> I don't know if that's going to be worth anything. Back. Yeah, I know. Bizarre I backgrounds, glow caps. Oh, wow. Those are taking me back. Let's actually... <laughs> Let's have a look. Uh, the sad thing is that some guy's probably trying to produce a whole, like, cap. fucking, you know... There is one of Bob, Glow Caps Red Glow, The Simpsons, 1994, 46, $10 selling See, for. Before we had like reaction gifts and shit, we had this crap. <laughs> and fucking, that was it. That was like, that was, we were fucking impressed by that. Like, like fucking, you know. <laughs> like, and like, so it comes off. And then you put another GIF in there and you can look at like, I don't even know what that fucking was. I have no fucking clue what I was looking at. Like if you kind of put it in wrong, it's almost interesting, you mm -hmm. know? Like you get something fucking out of it. Let's chuck it right, upside down doesn't work, but like, is that a Smurf? What the fuck am I looking at here? Oh yeah, see that? That when you fucking like jank it up a bit and like, uh, 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 like you get almost like something fucking, mm. you know, it kind of fiddles with the brain. The rest of it's just kind of like, I'm not even sure. We have a big gay owl. Looks like a tiny black child. A big gay owl stick sticker. <laughs> it says Thopar on it. I got this, I believe, out of the South Park show bag <laughs> from the Echo. Uh, I don't think that's worth anything. Just trying to, you never know. Just trying to fucking, you know. Another example of the Echo trying to turn you gay. It was a Palkia. Tell me that doesn't look like a penis. A monster penis. Okay. It's a Pokemon. Um, what else we get it? Oh, we got a bag, a little baggy of something. Some More sort pods. of Tarzos or something. <laughs> I know. I don't know if you've had these everywhere else, people, but like Australia had its own like kind of reject pogs. These are flying chopper caps. I don't think it's gonna be worth anything. No, these are these all connect together. Now you connect them together to make things. <laughs> See? They click together. Okay. I don't know why. I mean, like, this one just looks like a bunch of cows, so, you know. Let's look on eBay. Flying <laughs> chopper caps. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's just fucking... Someone drew these. That's my favorite thing. It's like, this was someone's job was to probably... There we go. Ten, like... ten chopper chop cup caps or $15. Uh, why? I, forget, I don't know. Let's see if, it, if any of them actually sold, though. Cause that's what I'm interested like in. You can't just make, you know, just cause something's rare doesn't mean it's like good. Yeah, you can stick them together. <laughs> <laughs> like people fucking, you know, oh, everyone looks at their phone. Yeah, phones are interesting. Like it updates, you know, something happens on my fucking phone. It, fucking that, you know, that's, that's what we were doing before phone. All right, so a full set sold for $100. Ugh. So, like, I don't know, there might actually be, these might be worth something. There you go. I mean. To someone. Yeah. They're not worth anything, but they're valued at Ooh, there's a Tazo in there. That's a different one. That's a Time Warp Tazo. That's got the... 
It's Roadrunner. Mm, Wiley e. Coyote. Isaac Newton. All right. So we that's, gotta, a, that's a Tazo. So we got to keep the choppers. I don't know what, you know, again, it's the same. It's got the same little like fucking weird, you know, almost Resident Evil key holes cut out. Oh, look, side here's of a Space it. Jam like Tazo. You're going to get like four of them to fit into like a thing. It's doing that lenticular lens shit again. That might be worth something because it's got Space Jam on it. All right, so we'll try mm. to keep these. So we'll there keep we these segmented Shaq. into. And then Isn't like, that Michael Jordan? I don't fucking. I don't Michael know Jordan was in Space Jam. Probably. Yeah, it was Michael Jordan. That's right. I've just been. I've been thinking about Shark a lot because I've been still concentrating on methods of weaponizing. There's a lot it. of lenticular shit in here. This, this, this it was the only thing I believe is a Disney thing that came from McDonald's. Um, oh yeah, it's like Hunchback of Notre Dame, which was a weird thing to make into a fucking oh, right, you know, into a goddamn Disney movie. Like ah, oh, coming this summer, Disney's Irreversible. It was a Digimon lenticular? Oh, watch out! We got more glow caps. Uh, this is Casper the Ghost. <laughs> It's one of the uncles. Are any of these worth anything? Um, let's have a look. It's a fucking, this is what life was. It was just like, oh, yeah, have a circle of fucking cardboard with like a shitty fucking drawing on it. Thanks. <laughs> fucking go play with that. Five minutes until I fucking, you know, find a way of launching it at my brother. I remember, yeah, you used to get, you used to get a box of 10 of them. It was insane. What else we got in here? Oh, more Hunchback. Yeah. I believe they all formed a picture when you interested. got the whole thing. Got Harry Potter chocolate frog cards. They're a little bit newer. If Harry Potter's practically modern. I don't want any of that shit. All right. Let's keep these all separated. Got Digimon here. Uh, it's got... Mm -hmm. So people about to make out on a lenticular lens, that's the shit. <laughs> We've got more of the Time Warp Tarzos, which <laughs> these actually might be worth something um, just because they're Looney Tunes and Space Jam. I feel like the one with Michael Jordan on it might actually. Like, because Space Jam, Movie Motion, Bang, Headbutts, Foghorn. Holy shit, they've got the old Frito Lay symbol on them. This is the lowest res of anything I've ever seen. More Digimon. <laughs> Casper fucking. Like, is science able to make lenticular lenses better now? Like, using, like, I don't know, some kind of computer in, like, a fucking, you know. Well, this, these one, this one's a newer one, it's better. That is a little clearer. Oh, know, shit. I will give it that. That is a little clearer. Actually got the Simpsons Glow Zone. Glow caps. Glow Zone made in Australia. Don't open them. They're, this is actually sealed. Oh, wait. No, it's open at the bottom. <laughs> I was going to say. It's got the sealing on the top, though. I guess some sticky tape. So there's a red grandpa. <laughs> I am the There's grandpa. There's so many. This before me. Two, like, what are they supposed three, to do? Glow four. in the dark. They glow in the dark. Yeah. What's this fucking weird form? shadow versions of the goddamn? Collect all of the six mystery Simpsons in the red glow cap prizes to win. Send them to the following. Cash in on to, that. To receive a full set of sixty mint condition uncut Simpsons. You know, it doesn't actually have an expiry date on it. Where's my glow caps? Have you got the full? I don't know. I mean, there's Barney. I assume I wouldn't solved. have the full set because I would have sent them in. <laughs> You'd think. Like, as dumb as all this shit is, it's like, I, I kind of respect it a bit more than the modern shit. Because at least, like, you know, at least there's some unique artwork here on, like, those stupid fucking apes. Honestly, anybody who buys those things should have their fucking genitals mashed into a paste. What, the NFTs? Yeah. Yeah, I agree. It's just, just worthless subhumans. Although I've thought Abs of like... And it's like... I'm not going to lie. I've thought of making an NFT at some point just to 
fucking oh, make no. money. If the goal is to like exploit worthless subhumans, look, fine. I mean, I'm at the point where it's like I'm running out of the sensible uses for them too. Yeah. What is this one? Grumpy Hot and Grinner. Cool, freaky zone. This could be a wait, I'm reading. This could be a hot or cool cap. Rub it or chill it to reveal its see freaky secrets. I don't even know what this one is. Do you know what that is? <laughs> it's just like, no, the point, it's not even like it's not even branded. Like this is fantastic. It's just some guy from like I want to say Saturday morning cartoon Aztec period. <laughs> Come on over there and stick it with my spear. Like, someone might have made this at home. Some, like, fucking mum made this for their kids so they could have their own fucking Tazos. You know? Like, that's what that was <laughs> foil, too. World Pog Federation. <laughs> Just fucking goddamn from 1994. Everyone was making Pogs. Yeah. Like, time to split Buttercup. What? No, these, they were fucking everywhere and briefly. This one's called Stinky Likes. <laughs> 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 Stinky likes. <laughs> I'm gonna make that an emote. You know what? Yeah, I was about to say like that's these are the emotes that you could just, <laughs> you know, your friend would say something funny and you'd flick a bit of cardboard at him and you go, that's "What's that about?" Oh, Stinky likes. That's yeah, another okay. flying chopper. All right. <laughs> Fucking world pog federation. <laughs> Fuck. I do you suppose they still sit in council? Around a giant table. You'd hope so. A huge... You'd hope the pog. A massive stone pog that was first carved by fucking... You know, Holy shit. A, ancient English fucking druids. <laughs> Sonic pog. I love, like, the slightly crouched stance. It reminds me of that, like, DC new god, like, whatever his name is with the weird helmet. Mm. And he's got, like, this space scooter, and it's the dumbest fucking thing, because he's kind of got to pop half a squad, and it just looks like, it looks like one of those toilets you've got to strap a weird fucking, you know, special needs kit into. All right, what else we got uh, in here? Let's... You know, just, just pour it in my lap. It doesn't fucking... Oh, you found another one of those weird mystery fucking yeah. pogs that doesn't I don't know have what they are. anything on it. Like, who is this guy? What's his deal? <laughs> fucking just no-name brand fucking pogs. Simpsons Tarzo. Getting into the... I'm gonna keep these all separate. I feel like this is a great metaphor for, like, the dangers of sexual assault online. <laughs> Just, you've just been cyber molested. Like, because we put cyber in front of fucking everything except molested. You're not ready for this button. I'm probably not, no. <laughs> Show the camera. Oh, man. You know, this could go up for sale. The gays would love this. Boys are great. Fucking hell. You wore that at some point. Of course. That's the best part. That's, that's the detail I, I, I love here. Oh, yeah, the Impossibods. That's what these are. I remember these. <laughs> you see couples like this around, too. Well, how else do you get the parasites off? Fucking. <laughs> <laughs> That's a great look. Jordan finding out you've been talking shit. There's so many Space Jam ones. <laughs> These all are terrible. These are all terrible things. And the, the sad thing is someone will buy these. Fucking yeah, we just fucking saw that on fucking eBay, like... Oh, we got a Tarzo Slammer, and that's how you'd play the game. Yeah, with I the always, slammer. What the fuck was the game? Um, you made piles of them and slammed them. I... That's the gist of it. I don't know the intricacies. It sounds like shitty version of Jax. Mm, mm, essentially. Which itself is a shitty fucking game. Like, more Simpsons, Tarzos. Slammer. Mm. Damn it. Oh, this is the one of Michael Jordan. Ow! Okay, <laughs> that really hurt. You got me, like, right in this fucking small of my foot. This one's Still one of Michael gone. Jordan, like, getting sucked into the hole. It's pretty funny. 
<laughs> than being seen, seeing fucking birds. This is, it's, I don't know, these have legitimate artistic merit. Like, Holy shit. Like, imagine having to explain, imagine showing this to a fucking child today and explaining it to him. Goosebumps, like, action card. Like, yeah, look at that. It's like, well, what is it? Well, we'd wiggle these and we'd look at them and we'd go, huh. Oh. <laughs> I don't know where this came from. It might have been that, there used to be a, a religious family that lived across the street from us. That's And the, yeah. the little girl there used to bring me, like, religious shit. Right. Like, psalms and shit. And... I mean, this has some ironic value. <laughs> you know. Trust the Lord. Doesn't it say praise? Oh, no, it does it say trust, trust the Lord. Yeah. Oh, God. Trust him with what? Uh, <laughs> just in general. Because that's the crazy thing about it. It is just, just in general. This is a pog that came with sanitarium rices. May I offer Madam a nut? Oh, yeah, Simpsons glow caps are different to the Tarzo. So we're going to keep those, those separate. Right, we gotta, we gotta what else we got? We got no madness pog. These are better than NFTs. Because you know what? Oh, they're physical. I, well, yeah, and there's like fucking drawings on them, you know? Like, I'm still like, I'm enamored with like fucking what I can only assume is like the Grim Reaper for beans. I feel like it might have been the dungeon from the Dungeons and Dragons cartoon. No, I remember the Dungeons and Dragons cartoon. Wasn't it? Well, I mean, like. I don't know. I mean, it has that fucking Saturday morning cartoon quality to it. Yeah. But if these were Dungeons and Dragons, I mean, A, Dun the Dungeons and Dragons animated series ended way before fucking Pog. And B, these would be labeled somewhere. Mm. You know, there'd be something. I mean, I, I, oh, fuck yellow tech. <laughs> better than blue tech. Why? Don't know. All right. Got me. Oh, hell yeah. Some like season two <laughs> Simpsons things. <laughs> So many fucking like a 3D caps, one or dude. something. Now I know why my parents are like, don't want to buy me shit. Because like the amount of shit that I have, you know? Yeah, no, I'm with your parents on this one. No, I'm just like parents in general. Yeah, yeah. Like, they break, oh, I got another fucking Sonic Pog. I mean, that is one thing. Like, at least if the nitwits are buying like apps and shit, it's what? like. <laughs> it's not even, like, it's not even centered. Oh, watch out. It's not centered. Center Chat, we have the Cruncher. <laughs> Is this another slammer? Yeah. Okay. Don't slam me. Damn. <laughs> I know where you're going straight away, fucker. Ow. They really do hurt. Slam yourself. No. No, oh, why? Because oh, it that sounds hurt. foolish. I mean, it wasn't. So this is interesting. See, like, there's, there's strategic, because the, this slammer and the old slammer aren't the same size, and this one's a lot thinner. So there's already some slammer strategy, you know? <laughs> oh, lordy. Yeah, I can't, I can't buy a thick NFT and wing it at you, can I? <sighs> Fucking... You shouldn't be allowed to vote. It should just be like, you go on a special list, and you get taken to, like, you know, a booth, and it's just like, you get to choose whether you like Oh, I got some stamps in here, too. Better. I used to collect stamps. Okay. We got some stamps. Let's just can mail these to someone who gives a fuck. There's not many. <laughs> no. <laughs> it's just other dudes our age. All right, we're nearly through the first container. That just feels a little. Uh, I feel like we got like this is one of the worst this containers. A, this is called Pervo and Blondie. Oh shit! It's a slightly, you know. Oh look, it's could have uh, masturbated to that in 1994, you know. You could. Oh no, Billy! Where did you go, Billy? I dropped Billy. You know, would have been happy for it. Do they have any of these like lenticular porno? Oh, like, fuck yeah! Look, look at that Robotnik. <clears throat> That's a good Robotnik. He's robot thick. <laughs> it's Jordan dunking. Who doesn't want to see Jordan dunk in lenticular format with that buff rabbit? <laughs> All right, there you go, growth fans. <laughs> it's like fucking 
bugs. Ah, oh, the muscle porn people. Look, it's Billy. Oh, and they all mercilessly teased, even though he wasn't like, he, yeah. Poor guy. The one who mercilessly teased for being gay. Where is the, uh... <laughs> they homophobically abused over here. Thank you. What is this one? Maui. And sons. What the fuck? That rings a bell. Shark caps? I think this came with a hat. <laughs> I want this to be worth nothing, but it's probably worth the most. <laughs> <laughs> only one was made. Yeah, it's shit. Still, there's only one. All right. Fucking, okay. Another slammer. There's only one of this rock. Like. Ooh, the official Tarzo. Like. That's a nice slammer. Another, you know what? Another Billy. I hate agreeing with you, but that is a nice slammer. Because <laughs> as, we, as, as we'll see, here's this slammer. Which, Which is just is, a sticker. Yeah, it's a sticker. It's a little gaudy. You know, there's like there's a there's a thematically appropriate character there. And then you get fucking this. Now look at this. Look at this, ladies and gentlemen. That's yeah, that's some fucking home shopping network shit for that. Like that is, you know. Oh shit, we got some more of those pure plastic of some description. Fuck yeah. These really are just insanely generic. It kind of looks like someone just watched Fist of the North Star. Mm. Lady and guy with robot arm. This is, a, yeah, you pull this slam around. People know you mean business. I mean, it's, there's like purple coloring. What I assume is one of the, yeah, it's one of the Caspers. So, you know, it's purple with a jizz specter on it. <laughs> you, you get that out at the fucking stack or whatever the fuck. And, uh, you know, people know, oh, oh. people know you're here to slam. Hold the phone. We have a NRL hog. Oh, uh, hell yeah, for one of the like fucking defunct Gold Coast fucking. Mm hmm. Yeah, I was trying to hit Aaron in the ankle with and that slammer. Him. Yeah, it didn't, didn't quite. I'm didn't. glad. That I, only, I only sucked. get one shot. Oh. Peter Gill for the Gold Coast butt plugs. Who the fuck is Peter Gill? D nobody knows. Most of these are just like those fucking Connecto Tarzos. Ah, oh, fuck yeah. Look, you know, gay Hollywood propaganda. You know, bugs making out with Michael Jordan. Excellent. And you can just relive that moment over and over again. You can make him kiss a lot more. See? Mm -hmm. Like, it's like, it's not just one smooch now. It's as many, you know, as you want. I hope these are working on the camera. I assume they are. Would you oh, hell yeah. More of fucking, more of my fucking generic guys. I love this. This is great. <laughs> I really want to know where they came from. <laughs> it's so good. Like, I'm keeping these ones. I'm keeping my fuck fucking off. team generic. Fuck you. You find out what they're worth and I'll buy them from you then, champ. Yeah, if you look up like fucking... <laughs> Can't you know, just keep my childhood, robot, sir. Um, Gary. You do about it. You're gonna cry. You're gonna cry, Aaron. You're gonna cry. I just won't drive you home. Doesn't matter. I'll butter pogs. <laughs> I'll I'll simply flash a little that by the side of the road. I've got another. I've got another nice slammer. Limited edition. Oh well, we've hit fucking. That's like this. You should keep. This has meaning. This is culture. Look at this. <laughs> this, this has weight. Ow. <laughs> Look, it's important for the people at home to know that they do, in fact, slam, okay? Because, <laughs> you know, what is, the, what, what is that? That could be fucking anything. I could be making that the, the slam ability of this up, you know? Now, if anybody asks you on the internet, it's like, hey, do you have these slammers? It's like, yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Do they slam? Yes, I do. Yeah, they slam. yeah, they've been tested on that little bit of my foot in the arch. That's that farting hurts. robot. You know what? I like the butts at the front. That's, Front that's really butt. like, that's unshackling yourself from, you know, the human form when you build your robot. Because there's no reason the butt needs to be at the back. Mm. And if you're building a robot to fart on people, yeah, put it at the fucking front. Why wouldn't it be at the fucking front? It can be anywhere. Don't let your front butt be non- Holy shit. Holy shit. <sighs> I think that goes with those other ones. I think it does too. 
This is the best. It has to be something. Like it's nothing. It just says made in China on the back. These are just generic. <laughs> Where the fuck did they come from? Maybe like crazy clocks or something. Like yeah. This is fan. This is the best. Like this one's 3D. Fuck a look at that. You can get some angle on that slammer. Like that is like this was carved from. You can put it on a shit. Oh no. You wow, can put it slams. on a ring and fucking punch people and have the indentation of it in them. Like it's got it's got it's got a little bit more weight to it as well. My my beautiful like, I love it because like the, you know they gave they, they had to come to make these off of original properties or like you know come up with a whole fucking cartoon to validate this shit because it need it needs context. Mm. You know, without any context, none of this fucking matters. Kids wouldn't fucking buy it. That's why you got shows, you know. Like no one wanted to make a show about fucking sharks that swam through the fucking ground. <laughs> but people were like, hey, we got some shark toys. It's like, all right. I got your back. Another football. <laughs> fucking the honest, honest to God, rugby league pictures. Some of them are fucking gems for the faces. Like, oh, I'm gonna get in there with me, ball. Oh, that is the face of a man who does not understand consent. Just fucking look at that. That scares me. Uh huh. All right. Where's my generic slammer? I'm gonna ruin you. What no, the fuck is this? Don't fucking fuck my things. Oh, holy shit. That's the fucking dad from Casper. Yeah. All right, come with me on a journey into Bill Pullman immortalized. <laughs> On a fucking pog. <laughs> <laughs> fucking look at that. Look, look at the fucking... Look at the expression on his face. Like, it's like he's listening to a particularly interesting academic talk. Oh, gay. He's like... Where are the Caspers going? I can't... Caspers. Oh, there they are. Right. Maggie two-minute noodles Godzilla cards. <laughs> they just... They put shit in everything. everything yeah. Printing technology. You remember that fucking shitty film? Yeah. It's like the worst bits of a Godzilla film and the worst bits of a Jurassic Park film. The more of those. The fuck? Oh, holy shit. It's like the fucking Batman fucking little things. Look, it's one of the forgotten Chris's. O'Donnell, I believe, was that. Oh, it's, I that fucking his name. I didn't even know that. There's like shitty wrong Bane. <laughs> oh, Bane. Emma Thurman when she was accessible. Thuma Ehrman. Fucking. Oh, hell yeah. A fucking wiggly tough. Look at that. Tough in the puff. Ah, oh, it starts as a jiggly puff and it turns into wiggly tough. Holy shit. You just blew my mind. All right. See, like, I maintain the dumb shit that I buy today has more, like, going for it. I was gonna say, where's this from? KFC. <laughs> <laughs> Is it actually? Yeah. Oh, that's funny. Oh, fuck, actually, you just... Ah, that just triggered a memory. Ugh. KFC episode one droid. Digimon. God, you've got a lot of these fucking hunchback of Notre Dame's. Hunchback, Notre Dame. Hunchback, Notre Dame. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right. I mean, your parents were right to yell at you about all this shit. That's all I got. I'm just... No, they never yelled at me. Okay. I was just saying that, like... Well, they're all right to just yell at you in general. It might have been specifically about wow. this, but... That's mean. <laughs> Who wants more buttons? Bat buttons. Well, none of these say boys are great, so... You probably would have gotten picked on less. <laughs> You know, like the, the the blue ones actually fucking you could you could wear that, you know. 
That fucking, I don't like that white one, the design on it. That's actually cool. The design of the white one's not bad, but I also feel like it's just trying too hard. The one that's got like the fucking just blue Batman is just like fucking... That's just a sticker. <laughs> that's funny. I feel like this goes with Team Generic. I love my generic guys. Someone drew those, you know. Someone had to have an idea one day. Would you like be thinking some like... radical stickers? Honestly, yes. <laughs> well, actually, the fun thing is working out what these came with. Yeah. You know? It's I did... like paper mate liquid paper. Fucking hell. I wouldn't have guessed that, to be honest. No, because why would you? No, this is great. I'm going to put these in my housemates, like, on my housemates' things, Excellent. actually, I think. Because Excellent. Small enough anyway. That's a good, this. that's a good thing. Because I, I do like the idea of him coming home and there just being, like, a tiny little surfer on, like, his phone or his PlayStation controller <gasps> and him having, like, I mean, he'll suspect me, but, mm. like, years and years and years of doing shit like this has made me exceptionally good at feigning ignorance. Because when you have a little brother and one, and that's it, and you're the only possible person who could have done what's happened to him. Yeah. You have to get really good at pretending you don't know what's going on. Mm, mm, 100%. Grab another tin. All right. I'm gonna... Another big tubbo ice cream. What's in here? I hope it's not just more fucking... All right, great. Well, it's not more fucking pogs. That's nice. Because it was just gonna be nothing but pogs, I was gonna get sick of this pretty quickly. All right, well, there's one hexagonal, hexagonal Tarzo. Somehow impossibly fused into a thin... So sure. they gave you parts of ships and you had to build them with the Tarzos. It was kind of like... Yeah, I don't know how that got in there. <laughs> it's not coming out, that's for sure. No. Oh, hey, all right. Okay, see, now we're fucking... We're almost... All right, that doesn't seem right. All right we need another fucking... Well, I'm, I'm like a bit of construction shit away from having a fucking TIE fighter. Oh, fuck yeah. Yeah, we got some fucking Grand Moff Tarkin as the fucking centerpiece here. Grand Moff. What a stupid fucking thing. <laughs> Look, it's hard, like, it's hard making up shit, but like, okay. Like, <laughs> Couldn't just, do better than Moff. I think really in a lot of ways, George Lucas is fucking terrible at it. You know, cause this Darth was the Icky. guy that, yeah, I fucking. We'll call him Darth Hickey. Darth Hickey. Don't, Darth Hickey. Fucking hell, this right. <laughs> Moff! Here comes Moff! <laughs> <laughs> oh, that is that's glorious. And I love, like Darth Vader's behind him, so they're like having a share a Tie Fighter, you know? It's like backseating him and shit. Look, just just let me. He's my he's my kid. I get to shoot him. Okay, I get to shoot him down. You know what? I don't care if you're alive with a moth. Okay, it's just I get to shoot him down. Okay, but we still and they had hole in there so you could hang them up. Okay, but we need, like, we need the all-important center face piece. <laughs> so... I guess this is the Star Wars Trilogy Special Edition from 1997. <laughs> I am fucking loving my Moth Destroyer. I mean, he's upside down, but if we fix that, you can hang it. Okay, so now we're getting somewhere. I feel like this is missing pieces. I got more pieces. Okay. They're coming. Oh, there's another one. Well, it might, it'll require, Jesus wept. All right, well, while you fiddle around, <laughs> I'm gonna try and piece this together with my brain. Just gonna be a fucking uphill battle. This I way. don't. I'm pretty sure that's cut off the back of a cereal box. I mean, it's just. I don't know what you. What this, this is weird for. Weird selection of it. ugly people. Like. <sighs> okay. Now these were cool. Oh yeah. It's a, it's a card, and it pops up. <laughs> My okay, so the, the, power got that. Like, are these the only bits I need, or do I need these bits? Do I need like a fucking constructor? No, because these are. You need, oh, the, no, you need, the, you need these. Yeah. See. So okay, so we do need those. Yes. All right. 
so I can find more. So are these not like two sides of one thing? No. Okay. No, these are more individual. Right. Because right, I was trying to like fucking make a fucking sandwich out of them. I, I was trying to make a, like a fucking, you know, thing. Oh, hell yeah, more moths. That's what we need. We're in a bit of moth fleet. Fucking a whole fleet of moths. Just Chewy. <laughs> yeah. Chewy can get in there. Just random shit from the movie, like just a slightly snow covered Chewy. And you're just like, oh yeah, there you go. There you go. That's that's a thing. That's merchandise. Is it? Like fucking is it? What is all this shit? And like, I don't want a sand dude. I want a moth. That's so funny. My father's contractor license. Oh fuck yeah. Carpentry and joinery. I'm gonna go fucking start my own business. Expiry date, 1996, Gabe. People don't look at this we shit. We have to go man. back people to 1996. Don't, people don't look at these things, Aaron. You know, no one's going to check. No one's going to be like, oh, I wonder if his carpentry and joinery shit's all up to if date. If you and I went back to 1996, what would we do? What happened in 1996? I don't fucking know, man. Watch out, there's an EverReady battery in here. And it hasn't leaked. <laughs> That's insane. All right, I don't think I've got enough. I've got a milk house. You know what I love about that? Yeah, no. It's unbooked because I'm obsessed with Mill House at the moment because his suffering pleases me. And my favorite thing about this is it, this, it's just Mill House. There is nothing, there's nothing else. It's not Mill House being interesting, it's just Mill House. It came from one of those kits. You know, when you make shit. Did it? I th yeah. Weren't you they make edible? Uh, there were edible versions. Yeah, they got taken off the market um, from food poisoning. Um, <laughs> Pretty sure that made people sick. <laughs> Uncle Toby's. Congratulations, you are the winner of a five dollar discount at Brash's. That store's gone out of business. The fuck was Brash's? Uh, electronics, if memory serves. Interesting. Right, look, fucking. There we are. I keep losing. I keep more morphs. Fuck yeah. You fucking, you know. You're flush with moths. <laughs> you fucking, you're good for moths. Yeah. Never, you know, you never had a, I had a, I had a moth in rich childhood. Can I say? Free Space Jam Shrinky inside. Remember Shrinkies? Where's my Shrinky? Okay. So maybe. Where's the pog part? Where it is? I cannot figure out how to fucking make this be a thing. No, I'm, I'm miss, I feel like I'm missing some key element here. You know, maybe that goes. You probably you 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 sort this out. You're close. Oh, those are side wings. Yeah, uh, those are the the S, the foils. I think these are for the Tie Fighter. These ones just like go in the center, around it. Oh shit! TV week card. <laughs> this, that is the most peak fucking twist shit I have seen all fucking day. Of course you have like, yeah, you had to make, this was what we got to jerk off to when we were young. It's like that, oh fuck yeah. Don't forget. I wonder what Kimberly Davies is now. Baywatch. <laughs> ah! Um, I don't know. Dead. Just, just hanging out. Probably just moved in down the road and we don't know. <laughs> All right, this is one of the oddest things fucking that you'll something. see. Um, so this was a Nickelodeon thing and it's a story and you fold it uh -huh. and it changed. See, like, so it's oh, a story yeah, and you yeah, read yeah. it as it folds and that's just fucking weird. You could say the story unfolds. <laughs> Whoa! I can get on there, you can't. You got a quick wit. You got Space Jam, Uncle Toby's cards. And they had Scratch and Win on the back. Interesting. Fucking thank you. These actually might have something to them. These DC cards. There we go. Fucking look at that. There you go, you did it. 
I love like the slightly off center moth face. <laughs> the best part is there's a moth pulling up the rear too. Oh, I forgot when they made odd bods, but footballers. Oh. You need to find these people and mail these to them. Or just find them on Twitter and start sending them pictures of them just to bother them. Because I bet that's a really excellent way to cyber bully some of these people. Uh. And they won't be prepared for it. That's oh, God, no. No one's sitting here going through all this shit and going, let's go mail this to people. He's probably really self-conscious about his weird big forehead, and now this company has come along and made a fucking <laughs> big yeah. forehead thing of him. Yeah, because, like, like do the, foot, the footballers would have probably no say in what they look like. I they mean, wouldn't no, even get shown probably. Have much of a say in what they look like. <laughs> <laughs> I don't mean like. I don't get to choose, Aaron. They should, you know. You should get to a certain age in life, and then you can just change. Because I mean, if footballers were able to choose, you know, would you choose that? <laughs> like a pan flute, bitch. Of course, you've got a sad little pan flute. <laughs> I was a child once, this may shock you, to learn. More x I'm tired of putting together Tarzos and I'm all moffed out. Well, have a pog. Oh. I'm assuming that was the pog. Like this fucking shitty Warner Brothers monster knockoff. Every, like, everything looked like this for like <laughs> the first half of the 90s. Fucking everything. <laughs> it was visually traumatizing. Fucking, like, you couldn't, you know, it's like how every fucking computer is RGB now. Mm. You know, and it's all just lights and shit, and it just, it looks terrible. It's terrible, it's trashy, hideous, just garbage. Like, oh, it's all the different color size, so fucking what? That is an artless piece of trash, you horrible pile of garbage. Look, some people just like to take LSD and stare into their cases, okay? What? Oh, just, again, like, it's like no thought's been put into like this shit of like what it's gonna be. It's just like fucking, you know, you crop on fucking ancient 90s Photoshop, which was probably an actual shop full of photos. <laughs> and then. No, you cut uh, the film. Ugh. Yeah, and I was just like, oh, you know. More football. God, this is depressing. <laughs> The football, like, that's the thing is, I didn't even like sports. The thing is, these are all fucking, like, you know, Aussie rules and shit. Uh, like, you're burying the lead somewhat. What about Mirage? Huh. That would have been cut off a actual, like, the toy. Mm. And one of the weird ones. The only Mirage I can think of is not that. Fucking goddamn Tarzos and Mick. I don't want to look at Mick Brickhouse. Uh, this, this, however, like, yeah, the Impossibods. They were kind of like garbage pal kids. Like, they were designed to just be gross. Oh, look, there's another Hypervision one to put in the thing. Oh, this is their Impossibods. All right, yeah, where's my fucking lenticular goddamn wizardry? Oh, oh, okay, yeah. that explains it. There's Pamela Lee. That's why I'm seeing a weird black kid on the fucking lenticular. It's Reggie Mon. All right, there you go. Let's see what this thing does. What does it do, Aaron? What do we see? You know, man. Tell us the future. It's a woman being crushed by a metal hat, which I will admit I did not expect. You touching my pizza, I kick at the goal. <laughs> you gotta warn me, okay? <laughs> that's, you fucking, that's, that's you part have of the, to warn the me. fun. You're not allowed to just... You touching my pizza, I kick at the goal. <laughs> like, is that, a th is that meant to be a threat? I don't know. Like, you kick at the goal for the other team? Like, what? Does he want me to touch the pizza? Is that the only way to motivate him to fucking participate oh, in his athletics? Why, Tiger's old. I actually have that, that, that white, the Zoids in the oh, office. Oh, yeah, that's not as good as Transformers. Look, it's a different thing, okay? I know. 
Why is it grey? Look, I will show you ha ha ha's, you motherfucker. Oh, Jesus, wept. I do, I really, because I feel like just sending them these pictures. Here's another sticker to prove this. <laughs> No, that's fucking great. <laughs> so this is what I mean, like, in when we were kids, our reaction fucking pictures, they were gone, you know? Yeah. That's finite. That's, you know, that's something. Cool. <laughs> I am gonna drive my fucking housemate psychotic over the next, like, month or two. Like, he's just not... I'm gonna absolutely deadpan him. Oh, just, dude. Eh, he's not gonna, ready. Not gonna explain it. That's, uh, the mask sticker. <laughs> Still on its original back. Well, I didn't stick it to anything, you see? I've got like just some loose playing cards in here. It's really <laughs> funny. Of course you do. You know, a fucking something blew my mind the other day. Like fucking Rugrats, the guy that did fucking, um. Come on, Brian. Eon Flux. Mm hmm. Did some character design for Rugrats. Oh, so he really? might have designed like fucking these Philip and Lily and the horrible little. That's weird. Yeah. Although they do have some fairly natural shaped baby oh, heads. They watch. Why did you just throw at the cat, the playing card? Yeah. I didn't throw it at the cat, I threw it. Yeah. And it just curved around and, you know, beautifully caught the air and proceeded to hit the cat. <laughs> <laughs> Not, you know. I do have a sticker pile. Yes. I don't know, Aaron. You've been just, you know, you've been you've been plowing through this. Well, yeah. I'm, you know, busy playing with like the fucking goosebumps dummy. Uh, he's gone now. Tarzos, how to play? Holy shit! Should to shoot a basket, place your Tarzo launcher on one of the launch spots, put a Tarzo on top, then flick the Tarzo through the Space Jam hoop. What? There's a hoop. Oh, this came with this was a fucking <sighs> little board thing. See now. You know, now there's a game, you More know? stickers. A big Buzz Lightyear sticker, just on something. Buzz to the rescue. I do like that they were called Buzz and Woody, you know? That is funny. It's very funny. Oh, bless you, Charlie. Hmm? I've got so many more football cards. Good, because I'm collecting bizarre oh, it's the drawn ones. I mean, don't get me wrong, those are funny, but like... My favorite part of this fucking Toy Story sticker thing is one of them is just the Toy Story title. Like, it's not even like the, you know, relatively meaningful Buzz Lightyear iconography. It's just Toy Story! It's like, okay. <laughs> that's yeah, going in the You house. know Toy Story, don't you? <laughs> yeah, that, that, that's going in the harassment pile. You have so many of those stupid footy ones. And it's, again, it's for fucking Aussie rules. You can put those with the other... Star Wars. Yeah, I remember them coming out, and that's and the thing is like even fun to make fun of. That's the thing is, I love collecting these, the other ones, like the you know, the Impossibles and shit, and Oddbods. Fair enough. The Impossibles at least had some fucking artwork. Yeah, they were you know? cool. And then like that's the thing, they replaced them with the football ones. Mm. Like then they just went away because the football ones sucked, and who's buying the football ones? Like the thing is, all of those footballers look annoyed to be involved in this, you know? Uh, there's some, some thingies we had. Around somewhere. I mean, look, to be honest, Aaron, I have been keeping track, okay? I'm, <laughs> I'm in the middle of trying oh, to fucking shit. deal with this. That was an actual pack that they came in. Like, and just the shittiest fucking caricaturist, like, fucking faces. Like, just... That's a nice bat pin. You know what? Uh, that's an actually nice Batman cufflink. Yeah, look at that. I can go with the. I'm glad the footy oddbods were the things that doomed them. <laughs> like a little mailhouse sitting there, <laughs> not even smiling really. It's just not even aware he was being captured for. Pog. Yeah. Or glow caps no or whatever the In fuck. pog form. I mean, it's interesting because, like, there were Tarzos and glow caps and shit. We all call them pogs. So mm. credit to fucking where it's due. Like, pog fucking got the market there. I kind of want to read, like, who was at the top of the pog empire, you know? <laughs> someone got rich off this. Or at least That's made true. some fucking money, you know? Someone made fucking pog fortunes. Mm. And I am terribly curious now. 
I reckon, you know, Pogs should come back and actually, are you they can't even a thing? slam an NFT. Are they a thing? Do uh, Pogs I, exist? I would not be surprised. Uh, inventor. I'm going to look at fucking Pog Inventor. I need to, I need. Michael J. Pog worth <laughs> the third. Michael J. Pog. <laughs> Oh, watch out, there's a still-in packet, fucking Poison Ivy, from Batman and Robin. What? A Sparky Elephant sticker. Harassment part. All the, yeah, all the non-fucking, like, you know, the no-name stickers that are just weird. All right, so, Pogs were originally milk bottle caps. Okay. Okay. There was a Japanese game called Menko, which has been popular since the Edo period. And was, yeah, basically fucking Pog. No, except with Japanese the religious shit. person gave me. Like, what the fucking good is that when he shall appear, we shall be like him, for we shall see him as he is. What's that doing for me? You're going to put it on a fucking card like that. I don't know. But we shall see him as is. Okay. <laughs> like, am I meant to be nice? Like, is that what that's supposed to mean? Am I supposed to, like, there's no content, like, John 3, 2. Don't know what that means, don't care. All right, so Menko came from Japan to the States via Hawaii. Okay. And then some mum taught the fucking, taught a kid how to do it. And then they were using, they were, they were just doing it with bottle caps mm. that had like, you know, art on them. Last tub, please. And I just kind of went from there. Now this, I think, is the good tub. Well, it has such stiff competition. I mean, we had footy impossibods, <laughs> Aaron. How will we ever you beat know? that? Footy impossibods. All right, this is looking... Pocahontas! Poke haunches. <laughs> I've got some of these ones over here. This one's got like basketball cards. So this shit. might actually have something of slight worth. Oh, loads of Batman Returns cards. More TV Week cards. Christina Applegate. You've got a lot of, you've got a depressing Richard Dean Anderson. Oh, he's no. stuck to Steven Silvagini. <laughs> TV week. That's that's MacGyver period Dean Anderson as well. That's the good shit. Like, why is he just in front of, like, the weird fucking cat tail reeds? Because he's lurking. Okay. You never know when MacGyver may pounce, Aaron. All right. It's got, it's got a fan mail address on there. Rad. Oh, holy shit, Joey Lawrence from Blossom. <laughs> Boys are great. Aren't they having <laughs> a giant fucking homer? Yes. <laughs> Excuse me, I'm pansexual. I don't care. The male or female, as long as the person's attractive. To me. What else have we got in there? Oh, holy shit! <laughs> Video Easy Star Card. <sighs> Something's still in its wrapping, so there's... What is that? Is that a Pokemon or a Digimon? a Digimon? Okay. I think. I don't know. You go through it. These are all getting into like fucking, you know, believe it or not, having Joey Lawrence's like fucking inbred <laughs> dog face staring at me <laughs> from the depths of a bucket was not. What the fuck was the star card? A pleasant experience. Um, oh, it was just extra shit. Yeah. You know, you'd get offers and stuff like that. I don't. 96. I don't remember getting these Digimon cards. 13 year old Gabriel convincing his dad to not w worry too much about what the ratings say on the side of the animes. You want some more TV guide? Oh, fuck yeah. Go TV ahead. week. Melrose Place. I feel like you're veering close to like all of the TV week cards. Hang in with Mr. Cooper. <laughs> I love the variety here. Mr. Bean. You know, 
Like, what other fucking series of cards would include hanging with Mr. Cooper and Mr. Bean? Jurassic Park. Oh shit, more. Oh, I've got See, there's at least doubles. behind the shit. Ah, oh, damn it, it's more Mr. fucking Cooper. And more Steven, Steven Stavagani. I hate that you've got multiple Silvanis. <laughs> You know, you could laminate the hanging with Mr. Coopers and turn them into some like pretty nifty novelty fucking earrings, you know. I might actually have nearly the full set of the Batman Return cards. Like look at all those. I like how the picture on the back says them eating cake. I watched a lot of Hanging with Mr. Cooper and I don't remember those other girls. One of the home and away faces. Is this one of those like shrinkers that didn't work? No, that's a chip packet. Okay. So you put them in the oven and you can shrink them. Make your own shrinkings. Genius. Look, a munted chip packet that Aaron kept in a tub. <laughs> <laughs> who, who, who on eBay would like to purchase a munted chip <laughs> packet? <laughs> yeah, a chip packet that's slightly, slightly roasted. Gently cooked. Like, I reckon I've got a lot of those. I mean, the full that, set. Yeah, I, I concur that that is a lot. How many are there of 50? Of 150. Oh, Fuck I that. don't have that many of them. <sighs> I've got a lot Batman of trucking, returns, a shit. lot of basketball cards. I mean, look, you can never have too many, like, Danny DeVito fetishes yes. in... Look, if you got a fetish for that DeVito, I worry for you. But I can... The Red Triangle Circus. That was that character in that video game we played. <laughs> that was the whole circus. I love... Okay, so... Fucking... I thought this dude's name was Anthony Boner, but it's Bonner. It's Boner. That's how it's pronounced. Um, One of the ends is silent. Like... Descriptions of what's going on in the card, <laughs> like the penguin looking grouchy and un uninspired. That's great. And it That's just, great. It just says that. Like. That's great. We should, you know, we should take that movie and put subtitles on, like, for, for the end, just those captions. <laughs> like, because some of them are like the names of the people who are, you know, there. It's like, you know, Selena Kyle, Max Shrek's secretary. It's like, okay, the Red Triangle Circus. I forgot it's his name like, was Max Shrek. Yeah. Well, you got him as well. That's yeah, good. <laughs> See, and then, then we get gems like the organ grinder monkeys around. <laughs> monkeys around, Aaron. He's monkeying around. Oh, I've I think that guy cards. died recently, which is kind of a, kind of a bummer. He was a very a lovely character actor that would pop up hither and thither. Would you like some like puns and shit? NRL cards. I mean, Lord no, but there might be some fascinating faces in here. <sighs> Lorimer. Oh yeah, there's Alan Langer. <laughs> Glenn Lazarus here having to push back against uh, Earth's gravity that he's only just feeling on the surface for the first oh, time. Oh man, these Lay's chips fucking things. They used to, they just say, they say a word, like this one says cowardice and then it says Newt and Rune can't resist. Appetite. Oh, Jar Jar no. can't resist. No, no, okay, so something's been stuck in my head. Yeah, something has been stuck in my head for fucking like 20 fucking years. At lunch one time, my cousin came up and just handed me one of those with like I'm a dollar on it and just said Padme can't resist and handed it to me. <laughs> and that stupid sentence has been in my head for like fucking decades. You have a frightening quantity of Malmaningas. <laughs> Maninga. Look at him. He had like one of the most hilariously short political careers ever. Throw that in there. That's not the same, but it's fucking it's close not, enough. It, it doesn't, no, I'm not, I'm not like putting Savijimijimi into fucking the... Uh, Obi-Wan can't I'm resist. Not, oh, Lord. You see what, like, look at this. Look at, look at that. Obi-Wan can't resist. And just fucking... Damn it. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, he's a fucking Jedi, so he kind of can. Like, I'd assume, you know. Like, I'm figuring, like, because don't isn't not isn't resisting a big part of being a Jedi in general. Yeah, you know? that's kind of part of the fucking job. Oh fuck yeah, Mace Windu KFC card. <laughs> well, that's just racist. 
Hey, everyone likes chicken. You That's don't true. like chicken? You've got so many doubles. Got to get it out there and start trading. Steve Ranoff played with his helmet like so much that to be fair, probably protected his brain. But like just between that and the head being down all the time, it, you, I just never saw his face. Like you just watch fucking games with your granddad and shit. It's just like, it's just this thing. <laughs> oh Lord. Like a duck. Australian television at its tragically finest. <laughs> <laughs> Here's Wendell Saylor not called, showing up on film. I had a character called Dicky Knee. Yeah, because he was short. Oh, man. No, like, and probably still to this day, and granted I don't entirely know, but like, for like the first 50 years of Australian television, you could just get by on your first idea. <laughs> you did, you never, ever, ever had to think to yourself, wait, what if this could be better? Mm. Didn't have to go through your mind. These stickers are so like the most 1950s fucking head of a human being. Like, just looks like a goddamn Dick Tracy villain. Look at that. Can you put that with the Batman card, please? This stinking city. The penguin voices his opinion. Holy shit, I cut out the fucking thing from Attack Pack. Can you remember Attack Packs? I've gone on about these before. Oh, yeah, yeah. Nickname, Rip. Full name, Rip Rat. Molecule Morph, Common Rat. Roll, Leader. Poisonous fangs ripped through flesh or steel. Sinister and power hungry. Rip plans every move carefully. He's smart and has an incredible ability to survive. I've gone through these fucking, like, rugby league cards, and then I just find... Sword. Weapon. The fuck is that from? I don't know. Hmm, interesting. Maybe that has something to do with the generic slammers. Maybe it was a game. I feel like the slammers would have something on them. You know? Like... Health. Mm. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Faces. <laughs> Football! Oh boy! Uncle Toby Sonic cards. People too fucking ugly to like get a job. Whoa. What's fucking like... Okay, like look, Sonic, the easy. It's, you know, you have to be either really deep in the spectrum or not deep enough to fuck up drawing Sonic. <laughs> this Tails, however, oh boy. It literally looks like he's in the middle of having a fit. <laughs> it doesn't look like he's doing anything. There's just shake lines around him haphazardly. Fucking get a load of this gem. Look at this, Aaron. Look, fucking look. I don't want to. <laughs> like, I don't, just... let, me, let me have a closer look. I want to look at his head. This, it, oh, yeah, dude. Like, that's what it looks like, like. One hand is that way, the other yeah. hand is the other way. And there's no reason for it. He's, he appears to be tremoring. These giant stealth park stickers. Yeah, that's right, that shit's 20 fucking something years old now, isn't it? Oh, dude, this is an amazing sticker. <laughs> Without any context, this is... This verges on sinister. <laughs> I did the right thing. Also, that's a great harassment sticker. Why would you sticker. need to put that... <laughs> I think I'll put I'll, I'll put this on his car. <laughs> <laughs> oh, more football. Oh god, more faces. I'm hoping for well, there's like a guy called Raper, and I find that very fine. More hey hey Sole. Oh Jesus. I'm so glad that Daryl Summers has been banished from Australian television. Where is he? Banished from Australian television. The Phantom Zone, as far as I oh, as okay. far as I recall. I wonder if it's fun. I wonder if he's having a fun time in there. God, he sucked. I mean, I will say one thing for this show. It actually had lots of it like it had stand-ups doing sets that you wouldn't see anywhere else in Australia. Mm. Fucking Bill Hicks was on that show. Why did it suck? I can't remember really the much rest of the of show. It. it was just like really 
Again, lowbrow first idea Ocker jokes. Right. And like that was it. Watch out, more TV week. Another one of Mr. Bean. <laughs> Just staring at that, like, why would you want that? <laughs> Maybe it's because I'm getting sleepy. Or like, yeah, no, here's a great one. A picture on the back of him just about to eat a baby. Because <laughs> yeah, he doesn't understand humans. I'm 100% right. Show me. Holy shit. You are. Yeah. Delicious. Tender. Crisp baby. I have got so many basketball cards. Look some of them up. Like, because if anything's going to be mysteriously worth something, it'll like, be a basketball look at the, look card. Look at them. All right, fuck it. That's that's too many. That's licensed to fucking put. I mean, you know, Gary Payton. Don't remember that name. Lennox Dominique De Heer. Well, he's certainly not De Vere. <laughs> Watu can't resist. <laughs> I'm not sick of that. That's as funny as it was when I was like fucking. R two D two can't resist. <laughs> That's great. I don't have the Padme though. Damn it. I mean, that does suck because Padme can't resist was fucking hilarious. <laughs> oh, fuck yeah. A heat sticker. So you rub it and it and you reveals. Ruin it. Yeah. I love this one because it looks like Craig Ello is afraid of basketball. You know? <laughs> Poor Joel Craig Ello. They made him play basketball even though, Aaron, he was scared of basketball. <laughs> <laughs> made him really good at passing. Yeah. Some fucking... Hey, you want a bunch of pictures of dudes? No, that's weird. All right, well, they'll be athletes. All right. That's okay, then. Yeah. Small Batman. Wow. <clears throat> Here's Brian Hill explaining that he doesn't want to be put on a Brian Hill card. I think it's oh yeah, these are coaches. Fuck you. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, that that screams coach. Yeah. It was definitely not a player. There's there's a man that uses the N-word and I don't mean NBA. Ah, I'm old! It took decades, but we finally got him to start saying coloreds. <laughs> this fucking picture on the back. There's a very horny... <laughs> that's a horny Bill Clinton energy. That's amazing. Uh, yeah. I see it in his eyes. Yeah. Someone, like, did you put this in the oven? Like, fucking. I mean, they have been in an ice cream tin for over 20 years. Yeah, but it's not like all of them, is it? No. God, you know, you get a lot of pictures of armpits with basketball. You know, it must be great if you like armpits. Mm. Look at that. That's like a fucking crazy armpit orgy that you can just look at. <laughs> on the, on, you know, you can look at that on the fucking bus and no one's going to, you know... I mean, if you're jacking off, people will figure it out. But like, I think you know, so. Yeah. You just, just cut a hole in your pocket, and it's fine. No one'll know. You can just, you can just go fucking. You can go wild. Oh my I God. don't. Like the problem is, is like none of the basketball things are gonna make sense to me, and they're not gonna leap out. It's not like I'm gonna be. Oh yeah, look, there's like a shiny shack. You know. Yeah. Have your goddamn fucking yeah, clothes just full of shit. I'll put this fucking half-baked one with the other fucking gently roasted one. How do I know if my basketball cards it's are valuable? It's in perfect condition. Well, perfect if you can if you consider an ice cream tin perfect. It's perfect. Like, look, it's perfectly good. It still tastes like ice cream. You know, it's got that going for it. it smells like it, too. Mmm. I can't wait for my housemate to find out that he survived the Thunderbolt. <laughs> I don't even remember that. That was the roller coaster, their first roller coaster. Yeah, fuck, guys, that was yeah, that's fucking ancient. I love how the shitty art on the sticker makes it look like the Thunderbolt's being ridden by nothing but lost souls. Mm. 
Like, get a, get a fucking look at the kids on the fucking thing there, you know? It's just like, faces just, it's just giant gaping black eyes and mouths. I'm just gonna they have to- They don't look like they survived the Thunderbolt. That looks like a, a lie. I'm being tricked into going on the Thunderbolt just so I can be sacrificed to the weird well, god. How do you think they built more roller coasters? I suppose, yeah, knowing, considering it's dream world, you know? I mean, the place has fed recently, so it should be pretty safe for the next couple of years. I'll, just fucking, I'll pick one out at random and Google it. Let's you just, just gotta not be one. the one that gets chosen, you know? Hmm. That weird koala that they have wandering around but never shows up on any of their promotional material. You just gotta watch out for that. Because if he, if he points at you with a Dagwood dog, that means that you're being selected. And uh, then you're gonna be fed to the fucking jaws of a ride that, um... At least these look like they are official cards and not like just things your mum printed out because she loves you. 80 cents. Ding, 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 ding. That sucks. I mean, you got a lot of them. Yeah, try try another one. It might be worth a million dollars worth of 80 cents. What is this one? This one's got shiny stuff on it. I'm going to try this one. I mean, if you had a hundred of them, you'd have 80 bucks. <laughs> you know? There'd be an algorithm out there that'd buy it. You know, just buy all 80 of them because it's not thinking. Oh, fuck. Craig Illo. Staring at footballer heads is making me tired. That's the guy who's scared of basketball. What does that say? It says, ow, basketball. Lieutenant Uhura? Like, fucking... 94... Fleep... Ultra. Fleer Ultra. That's right, because that was the fucking... That was the company that made these dumb things. Ah, uh, see, here we, here we get the explanation for why he's scared of basketball, because one attacked him. You see? It's closure. Yeah, I don't think any of these things are going to be worth anything, really. Like, there'll probably be one in there that's worth, like, ten bucks, and they'll be like, yeah! <laughs> Fuck yeah! How, you know, why isn't Craig Ello being terrified of basketball not worth something? That's amazing. I mean, that's, you know... Fleer. I right, that one. Because that's him seemingly enjoying basketball. So that's probably part one. We've got mm. part like two and three in the in the Craig Ello trilogy. What a trilogy. Some say it rivals the Star Wars trilogy, original trilogy. Trilogy of Ello, Ello, <laughs> Ello. A, A, under my Craig Ello, Ello. <laughs> They'll keep you safe from the balls. Yeah, that's the problem is I don't know any of these people, so I don't know what's who's good. Yeah, mm -hmm. like that doesn't like that doesn't mean anything, because I feel like some of the ones that'd be worth a lot would be some people that we just don't have any fucking clue about. Like one of those, you know, coaches has got to be really worth a lot to like fucking racists, you know. He'd just say it in the locker room. He didn't even care. Frankly, it made them respect him more. <laughs> On my day, it was called Negro Ball. Let's look up this dude. Let's see, uh, Rudy Tom Genovich. That's an incredibly American name sandwich with an incredibly un-American name. It's like a, a Russian spy who was lazy or skipped a couple of days of cultural training. Oh, there Fifteen dollars! It's not that card, though. Shit! Well, maybe ours is rarer. We've got him not hiling Hitler. He does it a lot. <laughs> oh, man, a signed one's only thirty dollars. Is he dead? I don't know. We'll kill him. That'll be I worth mean, more. I mean, if he is dead, that hair is still alive. <laughs> I mean, we won't kill him. Someone anonymous will. They don't have the one we have, which only means it's rarer. I'm gonna, maybe if I put number 283 in it. Uh, Let's have a look. There he is. A dollar fifty. fifty-five. That's one for I uh, signed. All right, so not only do we have, we have this shitty Rudy. Damn it, Rudy. Cut the poop, Rude. Come on, Donald Nelson. 
I uh, got stuck with the poop rude. <laughs> I don't know if the Donald, like, if the fucking Rudy was bad, like, you think, you know, I don't think this is, I don't think this is a fucking valuable series, Aaron, you know? <laughs> Pictures of coaches just sort of sitting down. The autographed one's worth $14.50. Well, you know, you got three bucks. That's, uh, you can get, like, a maxi bond. Ooh, I like maxi bonds. Are they, like, five bucks, dude? Well, shit. You know, inflation got to them while I wasn't eating them, so I'm sorry. Why does ice cream cost so fucking much? Uh, you know, the fucking... The fusion generator they use to combine the ice and the cream isn't cheap. We really should be using it to power our civilization. Cedric C. Bolos! Bolos is life. (laughs) He see Bolos. He is Bolos. Tom Gugliotta. That's a name. Sounds like he should be in the mafia. Jamal Mashburn. (laughs) Okay. I'm just gonna like. Just once I want one of these pictures to be a guy just fucking clotheslining a cunt. Like, just fucking. Craig, hello, hello. Bobby Phils, Anthony Peeler, Bimbo Coles. Show me what? The guy's name's Bimbo. That's gotta be worth something. Sure. <laughs> All right, let's have a look. What number is it? That is an amazing picture, too. Like, because what the fuck's going on there? One guy's shooting, and I, who I'm assuming is Bimbo Coles is like, got the ball somewhere else. Like, this is weird. What's the Someone number on the back? Explain this to me. 107. Like, what's happening there? That just looks like interpretive dance. Man, that's not bimbo calls. Dollar fifty. They all seem to be around dollar fifty. I mean, that's that's ridiculous. All right, too. people at home, I'm going to keep saying names. Sharon Wright, John Sally, Anthony Peeler, Bobby Phils. You, if you like, if you know any of these people and they're like, <laughs> yeah. you know them, like, because there's not many people out there that watch basketball. Sean Higgins, Sam Bowie, Mark Macon, Eric Lechner. Skipping some quality pictures here. Well, here, you, t- you take the pile as I go. But I don't want the whole pile. All right, well, I'll make a pile here next to me. <laughs> Larry Chris Kawayak. He's pulling that mouth face that the weird fucking emoji has. That's amazing. You know, that fucking Grant Samsung Long. fucking... Hey, look, any good... Look, I want you to put any good photos, like that one, put yeah. them in, a, in, in like, a good photo pile. Man, Eric likes to put some fucking feeling into his basketball. I fucking... I'm obsessed with that. Terry that. Porter. It's just fucking great. Lorenzo Williams. Uh, Eric Lechner's going in the fun photo pile. Chris Smith. I like... Sean Higgins is, is like, just about to go home. He's like, no, I'm taking <laughs> it. He's not allowed to play. No, it's my ball. This is a good one. <laughs> it's not, I mean, like, these are good faces if you think someone just told a large guy that they think their ball is stupid and ugly and they're desperately trying to, like, make sure the ball doesn't hear this, you know? Like, this one particular, this Sam Bowie one, he's protecting the ball's feelings, you know? Oh, Didn't you say that? Jim Lee dropped ball. <laughs> Kevin Willis, Kenny Walker. <laughs> Drop ball. <laughs> Dang Barros. I oh, know Dana Barros. My bad. Chris Korsh something. Chris Korshania. Shinia? Paul Pressy. Xavier McDaniel. <laughs> McDaniel? I've never heard McDaniel. That sounds like one of those fucking fake names that showed up on that weird Japanese baseball game. Dwayne. Shin, how do you say that? Shinsius? Shinsius? This is an amazing set of photos. There's like some fucking Akuma teleport quality to this. Mm. So it's only with this one. I like these three picture ones. This is amazing. Look at that one. These, yeah, these are way better. Like, there's like, we get, see, we get like, you know, several phases of Anthony Mason here. You know, there's like, <laughs> there's like him kind of ready. There's like him in the mid action, like, fuck yeah, like basketball. That's, that's the completely blank face. <laughs> like, nothing going through your head right now. And then there's like serious, serious Mason down the bottom. You know, some fucking effort. You know, you can't just like, oh, here's a picture of a cunt. Like, does this guy even play basketball, or is he just, like, fucking... 
I feel like this guy just like works in the fucking equipment shed. He's like writing down how many new sets of shoes and shit he's got to buy. Corcioni! There are a lot more Italians in basketball than I have thought. I suppose, you know, Mario has several fucking basketball games. People just, yeah, these were important, you know. So I gotta get my Kevin Willis to, you know, never know if he's gonna be fucking. This one's worth three dollars! Moving up. Yep. Yeah. All right, here's a picture of Lorenzo Williams really, really enjoying the dunk. Whoa, that's good. Just when you get it in. Reggie Williams played for the Denver Nuggets. <laughs> Nuggets is a terrible, like I know they that's mean an gold, awful, but yeah. still, like. Nugget. <laughs> I don't play for the Nuggets. Do you? <laughs> Nugget. Will. Purdue. It's like, okay, you know, what else are you going to say? You're from fucking like. What is it, Denver? Mm, Denver. Yeah. I mean, what else? Hey, what else are you going to name yourself? You know? The Denver, the last dinosaurs? <laughs> I mean, it's better than Nuggets. Dinosaurs are at least cool. You know? This one's not on eBay. Like Interesting. A cool nugget. Maybe it actually is worth something. Look it up on Google. Because eBay is like a narrow. Mm, yeah, yeah. A narrow search. You know, once the NFT market collapses in on its own stupidity, these might all get really valuable again as those dipshits sort of spill out into the world looking for actual things you can meaningfully own. I thought they were jokes at first, but there are people flipping out that other people are able to just like copy the picture. It's fucking astoundingly stupid. Like I, I, I was certain that it was bullshit. I was like, no, you can't be that fucking dumb. Doll 29. Oh, well. I mean, what if you've signed it? Does that increase its value at all? What if I've signed it? Two dollars on Amazon. Mm. It's two dollars US. Mm. This is my program for ISOs and shit. Yeah. And Just you can go like. Close it down so we can manage, see Aaron's. Arts, you know, yeah. Shit. It's cool. Aaron's piracy software. Excuse me. I am legitimately backing up all my own games. I, I definitely own all of these. Why are you worried? I pirate all sorts of shit. Fuck you. Ah, right, so we've gone through some stacks of shit. Now, if you want to buy any Correct. of this. Let us know. <laughs> For an obscene sum. We'll sign them. Yeah. Well, I will say, uh, you know, my collection of generics are not for sale. I still want to know where they came from. I might actually look into that. Try to find it, yeah. I was going to say, the thing, you close the thing. I was going to look up generic pogs. Because, you know, look at this little guy. I mean, he's, he, he's clearly meaningless, but he's so ripped, you know. Good for him. Good good for him for accomplishing his body goals and maybe the post-apocalypse? Maybe. Maybe. I want to wear my like, cause this... faith in the Lord ring. And uh... Because <laughs> this guy looks like fucking Anthony Hopkins from Waterworld, but it's not. Like, it's just, he's bald and has an eye patch and is smoking. Um, and I don't think any of the rest of this was in Water... If they were, Waterworld would have been far more interesting. You know, whatever this fucking, you know... Praying Mantis Grim Reaper. And the scythe doesn't even look like the right size. Like, it looked like he stole it, you know? It's not his shit. It looks like a really sad amateur wrestler. Like, if this guy showed up in Chikara and the, all the other Chikara wrestlers were making fun of him and it was supposed to be like that, that would make sense. Like, maybe people just made this shit by themselves because of that fucking milk bottle top thing, you know? Like, maybe mm. that was a thing. Yeah, I don't know, dude. It was odd. Ah, uh, that's been Aaron and Gabriel. <laughs> go through Aaron's yeah, shit. Go through Aaron's shit. Back in the tubs they go. Ah, oh, these are staying out. Well, yeah, I mean, you can't... Because that's the thing is, now I've got to sort... You can't get rid of weird, pensive... I'm going to sort these and try to sell them. 
Oh yeah, sure. Like, fuck it. I mean, you might as well. Give me something to do in the day. Yeah. And maybe I mean, some... I mean, I'm looking forward to the sticker placement, personally. <laughs> some good stickers there. But yeah, there's a lot of basketball cards to go through and they're all going to be worth nothing. So if anyone wants to buy a basketball cards... For something. For something. Yeah. I've got some. I've got a lot of basketball cards. All right, guys. Remember. Bad man can't resist. <laughs> Keep It Classy is proudly sponsored completely by its fans. We thank you for your support. It expanded somehow. I'll have you know.